Well, from breathtaking destinations to breathtaking makeup tips, courtesy of the Kardashians, contouring was hailed as the greatest thing since makeup was invented. But now there's a new technique in town which requires a whole lot less blending. Watch in wonder as Bailey Schneider shows us how to strobe our way to higher cheekbones in half the time. Hi, I'm Bailey, and today we're talking about strobing. And that is about putting highlighters on the places you really want to accentuate and you really want to stand out. We're going to place some highlighter, and you want a highlighter with a bit of a shimmer so that it really gives you that beautiful sheen. You want a dewy look. Because I want my cheekbones to really stand out, I'm going to put them right on the top of my cheekbones here. I'm going to put a little bit onto the brow bone, I'm going to put a little bit onto the top of the eyebrow. And then because I really want my nose to look sharp, I'm going to put a very tiny amount down the center of my nose. And the Cupid's bow is always the best place to put highlighter. And then we're just going to pat. You want it to really look like it's a part of your skin, to give you that really dewy glow. And just a little hint, you don't want to put your strobing highlighter anywhere that you don't want to accentuate. So if you've got lines in your forehead, don't put it on your forehead. If you've got really deep laugh lines, be very careful where you put the highlighter on your cheekbone. It just gives a really beautiful sheen, it's dewy, and it makes your eyebrows pop. It lifts your eye by putting it on the eyebrow bone. You have kissable lips with the Cupid's bow, and it really streamlines your nose.